What's up, my name is Simon and in this video I'm gonna show you step by step how to connect your MetaMask wallet to the Binance Smart Chain. If you don't already have a MetaMask wallet set up, I'm gonna leave a tutorial down below in the description that will show you how to set up your MetaMask wallet step by step. So let's not waste any time and get started right away. All right, so now that we have set up our MetaMask wallet, um, we can start and connect our wallet to the Binance Smart Chain. Because by default, it is, it is um, connected to the Ethereum mainnet because MetaMask was actually built for the Ethereum network. Um, I'm gonna show you everything in this video, but you could also go to this article right here on the academy.binance.com where this is basically the same thing I'm gonna show you here in this video. I'm gonna leave the article down below. Here you're gonna find all the necessary information on how to connect your MetaMask wallet to the Binance Smart Chain. And by the way, if you don't know how to get to this expanded view of MetaMask, all you gotta do is go to this um, extensions on the top right, go to your MetaMask icon, go to the little dots right here and click on expand view and then you'll get to this view right here. So now to connect our wallet to the Binance Smart Chain, we go to this um, colorful icon right here. Then we're gonna click on settings and then we're gonna click on networks here on the left side and we're gonna add a new network by clicking here at network and all the information that we have to put in these fields right here again is on the article that I'm gonna link down below. So here you can find all the information on how to connect to the um, Binance Smart Chain. I'm gonna connect to the mainnet right here. So the network name will just be Smart Chain. I'm just gonna copy, copy paste everything from this article in these fields right here. New RPC URL will be this one right here. Copy, paste, chain ID um, is 56 and current symbol will be BNB, Binance token, and then block explorer URL will be uh, this one right here. And again, I'm gonna copy everything, very easy. And then I'm gonna click save. And as you can see now, we have a new network and it should automatically connect me to this new um, network. As you can see here, I'm now connected to the smart chain network. And right now you can see that this symbol actually changed to the Binance, uh, the Binance coin, the BNB token. And sometimes it doesn't change. Sometimes you still see the Ethereum um, icon right here instead of the Binance coin. Um, don't worry if that's the case, it, should, it, it will still work. Um, as long as you can see that you are connected to the smart chain instead of the Ethereum network. So now that my MetaMask wallet is connected to the Binance Smart Chain, I can fund my wallet with some BNB tokens, some Binance coins. In, in order to do that, I'm gonna head over to um, Binance.com where I have some Binance coins lying around. And um, I'm gonna make sure to actually select Binance coin. That's very important. I've read from some people that have sent Ethereum to their MetaMask address when it was connected to the Binance Smart Chain and then they lost all of their Ethereum. So make sure you are focused and you send the correct coins to the correct addresses. So I'm gonna put in my MetaMask wallet right here and my wallet address right here. So I'm gonna click on my icon here on the top, the MetaMask icon, copy the address to the clipboard and then I'm just gonna copy it right in here. Or you could also just go to your MetaMask wallet, the expanded view and copy the address from here. Um, and then I'm gonna send it to the Binance Smart Chain. So I'm gonna select uh, this right here and um, now I'm gonna withdraw a very small amount of Binance coin to make sure this actually works. So I'm gonna withdraw zero point, let's say 0 0.05 um, Binance coin. Actually the smallest amount is 0 0.5. So that's what I'm gonna withdraw. And here's yes, the transaction fee. As you can see, it's very low. Um, currently compared to the Ethereum network, it's only a couple of cents. So here I'm gonna click on submit. And I think the first time you do this with um, your Binance account, you're gonna need to complete a quiz so that they can make sure you actually know what you're doing here. So just complete that quiz and then move on. Now here I have to, to confirm this transaction, I have to send a code to my email address. So let's me, let me just quickly do that. So I'm gonna confirm this with this code and I also have to use my Yubi key to confirm this transaction as well. And now um, the BNB should be sent to my wallet. It probably takes like a minute or so until the, um, the funds are actually on my MetaMask wallet. 
So I'm going to wait here and I'm going to come back when this actually went through. Okay, so it took four minutes and now the BNB that I've been sending is sitting in my wallet and I'm basically able to use it from here. Now, obviously it's not 0 0.05 because um, 0 0.008 BNB was paid for the transaction fees. All right, so if you found this video helpful, make sure you click that thumbs up button down below. That really helped me out a lot. And also, if you wanna see more videos just like this one, make sure you subscribe to the channel as well. With that being said, thank you very much for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.